The challenge today for a number of residential aged care providers is how do they provide care and looking after residents but still providing privacy and respect and dignity without in being invasive. So one of the challenges is that residents can tend to as they age can accidentally fall out of bed. And so what the care industry has purposely done over the number of years is what we call staff rounding or welfare checking. And that is where a nurse will actually walk into each room and each bedroom and check if the resident has fallen out of bed. What was developed in the 80s was what we call a bed mat. And this is a, a sensor that's actually placed usually underneath the sheet of the bed. It's a plastic sensor like so, and they've been quite effective to the point, but they're quite uncomfortable for the resident to sleep on. They're quite noisy. They also have a cable, which then plugs into the wall, which then transmits the alarm to the carer. This is also a bit of a challenge. This is perceived to be a falls risk in itself. It's easy someone could trip over this cable. Secondly is, is that these do wear out. They usually have a use-by date on them. They last anywhere from nine months to, to 12 months. Um, so the thing is, is that another form of technology that has been utilised is a, a movement sensor. This is a battery operated one with a very simple on and off. It's often placed on the floor or next to the bed, so when the resident gets out of bed, the sensor will activate. They can false alarm a lot. Um, they can also be not turned on or misplaced or knocked over or turned around. And so not really a, probably a very effective measure. What we've developed at HSC Technology is a new state-of-the-art sensor which then connects into the Talios platform. This is a, a sensor which we call the Sleep Sense. So it's a very similar concept to what we're trying to achieve with some extra advancements. This sensor is actually placed under the corner of the leg of the bed. It can go on all certain types of beds from wood, timber, aluminium, uh, with wheels or so forth. So this sensor goes under the leg of the bed and then simply plugs into the PowerPoint and then uses the Wi-Fi to connect back into the Talius platform to care, connect with um, the carers. What the sleep sense does is very similar to the bed mat, so it shows that the client's in bed and out of bed. It also uses ballistic cardiograph, which is a new technology, very similar to ECG, which is electrical cardiograph. So instead of electronic signals, we're actually looking for ballistic signals, which is the vibrations. So what we actually detect is also the heart rate and the breath rate of the resident in the bed. So completely autonomous, no nurses or carers having to do anything. It's, um, it gives a lot more dignity back to the residents, but we've now got a very uh, full dashboard of information. The advantages for this is, is that now we don't have to do as much spot checking. So the idea is that we know the residents in bed and if when they're out of bed, and we also know that they're breathing and alive. So this allows us to stop staff rounding. So this then allows carers to um, reuse that time in other more meaningful tasks. And if someone gets out of bed, it then alerts them to come and respond. Mm -hmm.